Hey everybody, it's me, Tracy L. Turner. I'm in the studio for my artist residency and I wanted to just check in with y'all. I haven't been able to make any videos or do much of anything since I hit the road and traveled all the way out here from Reno to Alexandria, Virginia at the Torpedo Factory. This is where we are right now. Uh, in a second, I will just kind of insert a little video to give you a short tour of my studio. Maybe in the next one, I'll actually walk around the art center and give you um, some close-ups of some people, some of the other artists work here. But for now, it's just me. Um, they're just closing and I'm just trying to sneak this in real quick before I head out of here. But yeah. All right, so here's some of my stuff in the studio. I don't have a lot because I came here mostly to work. <laughs> here's my workspace that I'm trying to keep kind of organized. And then these pieces are of the artist whose studio this is. So. Yeah, she has a lot of interesting things on the wall. Everyone thinks they're my stuff. <laughs> then I have to tell them, oh, no, 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 no. These paintings are mine. <laughs> so, yeah. I have them upside down so people can see them from this window here. And so when I'm sitting here working, people look into me, they look into the room like I'm in a fishbowl. So. That is the gist of the studio, you guys. Pretty nice. I forgot to show you guys these buttons that I got made. My friend Amy runs a business called Button Pusher NV, and she offered to make these for me to hand them out to visitors. Aren't they cool? Yeah, everybody loves them, and they're such a great idea. They have my website on the side, so... I mean, just genius. I never would have thought of it if it wasn't for her. And yeah, people get to walk away with cool little wearable art. <laughs> here I am. This is um, closing up week two of being here in the artist residency. And it's been going very well. I've been very productive and I'm meeting a lot of cool people, um, just the public that is walking through. So the thing about this space is all the studios here are open studios. So um, anyone that just wants to come in and enjoy the art can come in and uh, inside the studios and talk to the artists and see work. A lot of artists sell their stuff directly from their studios here. So yeah, um, forgive the lighting. I'm trying to kind of work with this here. Um, maybe I'm hoping I can kind of figure it out so the next vlog, vlog whatever, will uh, be better lit. Um, if not, just forgive me while I'm just, I'm not at home with my regular equipment, so these vlogs are going to be extremely different from the way I've been doing them before. So yeah, let me give you a little bit of a taste of what I've done so far. So I've been working more on the little hearts, still continuing this series. And as I'm doing more and more of them and opening up, opening up to the artists here about what I'm doing with this series and just hearing their reactions to the visuals or to the explanations of the work. It's been really cool and I'm seeing how even my own idea of this series is evolving and becoming a little more defined or at the very least, um, it's just fascinating me more and more if I step outside of myself, just seeing how obsessed I am with this particular image and was painting it over and over again and just kind of re-examining uh, the different I guess symbolic meanings of the, that image to myself so uh, I'm, I'm sure I will be writing a blog post and doing a vlog <laughs> about that particular um, experience with this series uh, but for now, I'm just going to skim through that because <laughs> I want to get out of here. So um, I'm also, I've also done this piece. This I finished yesterday. So I'm working on a couple different series. Um, I'm not sure if, if I've touched on these mouths. 
before on here, but if you follow me online or have um, read any of my blog posts about these mouths, um, yeah, it should be pretty familiar to you and I'm just continuing to flesh out that series as well. I want to get through these smaller pieces so I can get back to doing uh, more figurative work and larger pieces, but really I, I'm actually enjoying these smaller format pieces and, and um, yeah, the metallics you see now, I, I, I've just totally dove in and accepted the real metal leaf and now I'm really experimenting a little bit by combining the different metals, so there's copper and silver here and I know there's a meaning in that <laughs> somewhere I will pull it out but right now it just looks really cool and I'm just going to enjoy painting on those so yeah I'm, I like the smaller pieces because it is a little more intimate a lot of my subject matter is very personal and intimate so uh, not only just for cost but for just the meaning of these pieces working small makes sense to me uh, if you're an artist who gets told to go bigger, like uh, people, a lot of people tell me, just do what you want. You don't have to go bigger. Pieces can, smaller pieces can definitely work. There is a significance to it. Just make a bunch of them, you know? <laughs> so yeah, that's what's been going on so far. Just a quick check-in. I promise the next one will be a little more in-depth. I just wanted to say hello and give you a little uh, sneak peek at the things I've been working on and the studio I'm working in. Uh, the Torpedo Factory is awesome. They're super accommodating and um, I've met a lot of really sweet artists who have been helpful and have been giving me tips and just really good feedback about my work and not necessarily just positive feedback but really um, critical in-depth feedback about the way they're responding to my work. It's just a lot of information that I'm able to absorb and just kind of, um, it's, it's, it's encouraging for me as an artist moving forward. So uh, yeah, that is it for now. Drop me any questions or comments below. As always, you can follow me on Instagram at Tracy L. Turner and check out my website, TracyLTurner.com, where there will be blog posts and art and um, links to all of my other social media spaces and my Etsy store if you would like to buy some art prints from me. And yeah, I think that's kind of about it. Make sure you are subscribed to my channel so you can stay in touch with me and be in the loop when new videos come out, all right? So yeah, I think that's it. I gotta go, everything's shutting down. See ya.